and in today's video I want to talk to you about the Freedom Makeup Eyebrow Pomades and I did a video a couple, about a month ago on these products and um, I just kind of showed you what they were and the colours that they look like. I still have the same colours but I thought it would be a really good idea to show you what they actually look like on the skin and I can say is that since having these products I am an absolute convert. I love eyebrow gel, eyebrow pomades. I don't think I'll go back to pencil. The pencil that I have before I've barely even used since the last video because I just, I, you know, I love these a lot more. So I'm going to show you what they actually look like on the skin, the colour, um, and I hope you guys enjoy. The first one that I'm going to start off with is the blonde colour. Um, as you can see, this is the colour that I use the most every day, and I just feel like this colour kind of suits my skin tone really well and actually suits the colour of my brows. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of give my eyebrows a bit of a quick sweep over, and I'm going to do that using this bully brush on the end of my eyelid pencil. I'm just going to take a angled brush to help sweep the colour through my eyebrows. And then what I do is I take my spoolie brush again and I just kind of sweep it through the eyebrow once more. There we go. So what I'm going to do in this video is I'm just going to kind of leave one eyebrow untouched so you can see the different. Okay, so now that I've taken that one off, we're going to go to a slightly darker colour and it is in the medium brown. Um, I ha Again, I kind of use this for every day. Sometimes I, if I want to create more of an ombre effect, I will use the blonde at the very front of my eyebrow and then I'll use the medium brown just for the rest of it. So I'm just going to show you again what it looks like on one of the brows. There we go, and that is the medium brown. As you can see with the dark colour, it seems to make my eyebrows look a little bit more bolder um, and very full as well. Um, I feel like with this medium brown it's fantastic because again, it really blends well with my own natural colour in my eyebrow hairs. And I'm just going to let you guys see the difference again. And now I'm going to show you the colour um, of my eyebrow and how it looks with the dark brown colour. Now this one is a little bit too dark for me, I don't really wear it every day. I think that sometimes it makes my eyebrow look a little bit too bushy, so I'll try and do it as neat as possible. And that is the dark brown one. Um, usually sometimes it comes out looking a little bit thicker than this. It's probably why I didn't like the colour, but because I seem to have taken a little bit more time in it than I usually do, I'm not rushing in the morning, it seems to have come out really nice. And again, um, the hairs pick up the dip pomade really well. It blends really well, and again, it's really buildable. So if you want to start out really thin, you can do. And then if you want to build it up and thicken it up um, along your... Um, eyebrow line you can do and it seems to last for quite a long time so I would have to say that I absolutely love these brow pomades and to be honest with you I feel a little, little bit silly right now with only one eyebrow and another eyebrow so I'm gonna do the second one for you as well and because of the last colour that I use is the dark brown one and I seem to like this one at the moment let's see if I can try and get them to match up
And there you have it, there's both of my eyebrows now done in um, dark pomade. <laughs> Sorry about that, I was being really silly. Um, of course, these are really dramatic, they are quite dark for me at the moment, but I think I'm just going to wear it for today, for the sake of it, because I've done it now. Um, and again, like the um, all-time usual saying, which I'm pretty sure if you watch a lot of eyebrow videos, you might be a little bit sick of hearing, but eyebrows are sisters, not twins. So that kind of means that if you do mess up anywhere, you get one arch, which is a little bit higher than the other, which I think I have done. It doesn't matter, it's fine. Your face isn't absolutely symmetrical. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you like. And please let me know what you think of the products as well. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.